Hi everybody, my name is Lasha Royanko. Um, now, the channel is called High Voltage. I had to call it something, but I think I just might stick with Lisa Rojanko or Lasha Rojanko because that's my name, don't wear it out. At any rate, the reason I am here today is because I have been missing in action. I have not been feeling well, but I feel like I'm on the mend. I just wanted to review, in my humble opinion, based on facts, evidence, research, from watching TNT UK to watching The Royal Grift to my own research and using my own noggin. Now, the book that I'm reading right now, if you've never been to this channel before, oh, there's so many reasons I started it. But the go-to video to find out, whoops, that was not supposed to happen. I'm reading Ask Not. I know the whole world has finished this book. However, I'm so proud because if you go to my video as to why I started the channel, you'll understand why. I'm going to start reading Joan Bennett Kennedy. I say this every day on a short. I'm going to do this today, and then I don't follow through. So I say nothing anymore except this. <clears throat> I'm reading Andrew Gold's Psychology of Secrets. So when I first started this channel, I wanted to read books and talk about the origin, the intent and the goal of the channel, which you can find on the playlist, which has to do with medical malpractice in Canada, on Ontario specifically. I started off reading the Testaments. I didn't really understand what was going on. I do now though. Then. Oh, if I had only just kept on track with the Annalise Michael exorcism, which I'm going to start over fresh, by the way. I'm reading Ask Not and Psychology of Secrets by Andrew Gold. So I did a summary on a video up to page 38. I've had this book for approximately a month now. Thank you to a very special subscriber who holds a very special place in my heart, as all of you do. And Sarah, I haven't replied to your messages yet. Thank you for the new people that joined. And how I know normally is when people comment. I don't always get the so-and-so subscribed, and I love to give shout outs to people. Anyways, what am I talking about here? my humble opinion about the royal family and the secret they are holding, which has to do with Andrew Gold's Psychology of Secrets. Now, I'm not going to read that right now because I've done a pretty good job thus far, in my humble opinion. You have to give yourself credit for things or no one else is going to do it for you, but I will tell you, you know, on this channel, there's 630 people that took the time out of their lives. I had another channel, it's still up, all the same footage, 305 people that haven't unsubscribed, which is amazing to me. And the first channel I ever started was on this computer channel, which is why I'm looking into two, you know, cameras as it were because one is a video and this is a live. Okay, so one of the things that Andrew Gold was talking about in the psychology of secrets is why people keep secrets and why is it that people cannot keep things to themselves? Why do people share secrets? Or very serious subjects with total strangers, as I do in many of my videos. I really do expose who I am. That is because one day in my dreams, I really want to monetize this because I want to start a real charity. And I'm talking about, this is not a tax write-off. 
This is me creating content, hopefully that people will enjoy. And I don't want super thanks. I won't take donations. I want Google to pay me so that I can give people money in the community that need it. And community starts in the home. It starts with the people that care about you. It starts with family and in the community, grass roots. Now, the lie that is taking place, in my humble opinion, where is Archie? This is a very serious, 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 um, nefarious, obtuse decision the royal family has made in reference to keeping the whereabouts of Archie quiet. And we all know, hey mama, come on in. The dog's outside, I can't get her in. You can't get her in? No, oh, Megan is lying. Archie doesn't exist. My mother needs me. I have to go, but I'll be back tomorrow. And Sarah, I have a long message to send you. And Melody Moon and the gentleman from um, Montreal and Jesse who joined and John. Thank you so much. And okay, I'm coming, Mom. I'll be back to tell you that Archie, I, I, I believe in what Emma said because it makes the most sense. She was not pregnant on Oprah. There is no school. There are no kids. They don't talk like parents. I gotta go get my dog because she's my baby. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow for more fun. <laughs> Seriously. Okay, thank you so much. Sorry about this. Bye, everybody.